Hi guys, Shuhurat Jatra. In this video today, I'm gonna talk about double cleansing and everything I feel like you need to know about double cleansing. So yeah, without any further ado, let's get started. The only reason I am making this video is a beautiful lady commented me in my inbox saying you can use your foaming cleanser twice and you really don't need to use uh, any cleansing oil necessarily which is literally true i feel like you really don't need to use cleansing oil every single day it depends on what you are using as your sunscreen or as your makeup it depends on your skincare or makeup routine and uh, thank you to her that i am uh, making this video because yeah you really don't need to use cleansing oil every single day if you are new to my channel and wondering what is cleansing oil and why do we need it so the basic phenomena of cleansing oil is that oil attracts oil so your cleansing oil is made with sulfactants and that attracts kind of oil from your pores and it will clean your entire face without damaging your skin barrier irritating your skin and overall yeah it kind of uh, very smoothly remove every dirt and every pollution from your face so that is the main property of cleansing oil so there are not only one term like cleansing oil that cleanses our skin as a first cleanser there are micellar waters okay, let me show you so there are like micellar waters then there are cleansing balms and then there are like obviously cleansing oils yeah you can use these things according to your need like see what you really want if you are uh, if, if you are thinking of only removing your lipstick then you might use only this uh, micellar water because it is cheap it is effective and micellar water is made with micelles and my micelles have a head and a tail portion and the tail portion kind of attracts the oil and uh, the head portion is soluble to water and uh, the tail portion collect all the gunk and dilute with water and remove everything from your face this is the mechanism of cleansing oils and other than that there are cleansing balms uh, the property of cleansing balm is it is in a balmy texture but when you uh, rub it rub it rub this cleansing balm between your palm it will transform into an oil and then the oil will remove everything because it is a surfactant and that will remove every possible makeup every possible trace of makeup from your face and same thing goes for cleansing oils too as cleansing oil is already in oily form so it is the i feel like it is the mildest form of removing your makeup and dirt as a first cleanser but there is a thing you really don't need to use double cleanse every single day like if you are mostly in indoors just like me or if you only use sunscreen and you really don't use makeup in a day-to-day -day basis then you really don't need to use cleansing balms there are some sunscreens uh, that you really don't need to use cleansing oils or a first cleanse and your basic normal foaming face wash is enough to remove them all so these are some of the sunscreens uh, that if you are using you don't need to use double cleanse so that is this aqualogica chemist at play dermaco uh, minimalist and uh, then there is a blessing tree and these are the sunscreens uh, in which you really don't need to use any kind of double cleansing and next there are some categories in which you need double cleanse just like this lash shield sunscreen it is a venoma sunscreen like it is so hard to remove this sunscreen in with your basic cleanser because it just does not move away and it is irritating to my eye area and if it goes to my eye it is the end of the day for me so if you are using this kind of sunscreens you really need a basic like you really need first cleanser and now let's talk about what kind of cleansers i use so at night time i mostly prefer my foaming face wash so for foaming face wash i use this thc um, powder face wash and it is and uh, like it is an excellent product excellent foaming product and uh, she that lady said that you can use your basic cleanser twice and let me tell you a thing if you have used makeup or this type of sunscreen and you are planning to use your basic face wash twice then let me tell you a thing you are compromising with your skin barrier so this is the least good thing you can do for your skin 
so i tried to remove this sunscreen with this cleanser and trust me my skin was felt dry because i used this face wash twice so the conclusion is that if you have used a heavy makeup or heavy sunscreen uh, that is hard to remove then don't plan to remove that thing with face wash because it can damage your barrier and your you you will left with dry skin itchy skin and flaky and black and if you are not cleansing your skin properly with a double cleanse and thinking that you are fine you might have the clogged pores whitehead problems because of that because if you do not cleanse your skin properly you might end up with clogged pores whiteheads and uh, yeah even if you do not have acne prone skin you can get sometimes occasional breakouts because you are not cleansing your skin properly so it doesn't matter what you are using the mechanism is if you are using this lightweight kind of sunscreens then you really don't need to use double cleanse use your foaming face washes for one minute and you are thoroughly cleansed but if you have used this kind of uh, yeah this kind of sunscreens or makeup just like me you really need double cleanse to get a healthy skin because if your skin is not cleansed it doesn't matter what good serum or what good or what kind of good moisturizer you're using it is not gonna show a result on your skin because your pores are clogged your face is covered with a film of dirt so yeah i think that's all i wanted to let you know guys and yeah that's all for today if you like this video then don't forget to like this video i only make this video after seeing that comment and i feel like you really need to know these things too don't use cleansing oils blindly it's best if you use cleansing oil every single day but you really don't need to use cleansing oils you like yeah you 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 really don't need to use them because it depends on your regular activity whether you will be using them or not so yeah it depends on you so yeah that's all for today uh, like this video subscribe to my channel if you haven't and you can share this video and i'll see you guys in the next video don't take care bye